If you tried to seduce woman in the past, I can almost guarantee, if you don't really understand the female subconscious mind, you will probably be 80% under your potential. And this should terrify you. I mean I work with clients every day, and I realized, that the ones which not knowing the truth about the female subconscious mind, literally always staying under their potential. This is not rocket science. When this happens, 1. You stop trying to seduce women, which are actually interested in you. 2. You keep trying to seduce women, which are not actually interested in you, because you cannot interpret their signals the right way. Because you are not knowing enough of the female subconscious mind. So in both cases you are wasting your time and end up without any success with women. I put together a PDF, that will show you step by step, how to fix this in literally minutes. And I have done this for a lot of men, I have done this for younger guys, which want to start to flirt with women. I have done this for older men that want to start flirting again after their divorce. If you are not knowing this, even on a good day you are way too much under your potential, if you are not actually try to find ways to solve this problem. I will show you how to fix this problem in literally minutes. And I am not exaggerating, if I am saying, taking a few minutes. Just read the PDF I am trying to give you for free right here. Will save you 80% of rejection this month. Because think about it, take the effort you have every time, which results in nothing. So I am begging you, just click right here, read the book. And I will fix you problems with seducing women like I did it for a lot of other guys, you are about to see. secret trick to pass every woman's shit test. So you finally do not want to fail at all woman's shit test, like you did in the past. Great, then listen because I got very good news for you to pass every shit test in the future without any effort. And yes I know, even wives and girlfriends will shit test you, but trust me, does not matter who shit tests you, I will help you to pass every shit test. I do not want to make you fear anything, but if you do not know how to pass shit tests you will lose your woman in the long run. So there are normal and more extreme shit tests. Do not for, the biggest amount of shit tests or normal shit tests. The normal shit test will literally check if you are as confident as you seem to be. For example if she is asking you if you have many women. By asking this. She literally wants to check if you get emotional or irritated. By doing this, she will think that you are not that cool and emotional strong as you first pretend to be. You failed. So better react in an alpha and cool way to pass the test. Let's come to the next kind of shit test, to the more extreme test. With this she will do the exact opposite of what she did at the first test. She will see how emotional and loving you are. She is asking for example. She asks you if you have many women, or not. The only thing she changed in the question is the or not. The weird thing is, if you are answering in an alpha way, you will fail this time. And yes I know, this is very confusing. So clear things up, if she does the normal shit test, answer in an alpha way. If she does the extreme version, answer in an beta way, here are the examples again. Standard version, so, you have many women. Oh, am I that good looking, you think so? Extreme version, so, you have many women, or not? You were right, I am trying to find the right one, I am not a fool or a player. But let's come to the secret technique, which allows you to pass every shit test, 
no matter which version. First thing you got to do, is to take every shit test, like it is a normal one. This is a good idea, because the most ones are actually normal ones. But what happens if she is using the extreme version? So, you have many women, or not? Just agree in a sarcastic way. Like, I met 5456 women this week. After that, continue the talk, like nothing ever happened. This is very alpha, dude. In 97% of the cases, this will work and she will be more attracted to you. But if she is reacting in a way, that lets you assume she does not like it, just give her a hug and telling her that it has been a joke. So no matter what kind of test she is using on you, it will definitely work out for you. So I hope you learned some steps to pass shit tests in the future, but trust me, the by far best way, is to stop her from doing shit tests. The way to stop her from it, is by simply using a secret technique on her called fractionation. With fractionation, you will easily make her addicted to you, by literally hacking the emotional part of the subconscious mind of a woman. If you are interested in this topic, check out my free book in the description.